Hello everybody, so I'm here with another video and welcome to a new series we're going to be trialling here. Welcome to Jurassic World Evolution. Haven't played this on the server, uh, on the server? Good lord. On the channel, uh, before. But it's good fun. It came out quite a while ago now, they have actually brought out the sequel. So, not that new a game. But we're going to start a campaign. Uh, I don't have any of the additional things. I'm going to start a new game up. Hello. May I say welcome? Hello. My name is Dr. Ian Malcolm. You may have heard of me. Well, correction, you should have heard of me, especially now that you're here. So before you are the islands that you need to manage, if you can. The five deaths. Jeez, if only... If only there had been five. Mm, so in this game, you basically reclaim all the old islands from the Jurassic Park and World fi uh, films, and you basically reward the parts. And yes, you can release dinosaurs out to. Okay, to this is people. as good a place as any to begin. Isla Matanceros. It's relatively stable. Yeah, you can uh, you can get your feet wet here. And you should. Just diving into the deep end of the pool is where the big, angry, hungry things are. And uh, you want to be ready before you try that. So this is us uh, landing somewhere. I think we just ended up in the trees there. On our new island. And we're in the game. It's the drawbridge time. Finch, public relations and crisis management, and I'm here to help you. Wonderful. I have played this before, so You'll I know how some of the controls a work. Hammond creation lab. And the Hammond Creation Lab is where you build, or not build, it's actually incubate dinosaurs. I've already started on an enclosure for you. You should just attach it to the side. But watch out for dinosaurs. Ah, <laughs> just kidding. <laughs> I can tell I'm not going to be a giant fan of him. Um, apologize if this does become a little laggy. My computer does doesn't really like this game Let's at all. Let's focus on what you're here to do, which is create dinosaur facilities on the islands we call the Five Deaths. Actually. Las Cinco Muertes, <laughs> because Spanish is the lingo of choice around here. Uh, yeah. I unfortunately don't speak Spanish. You'll need to connect it to the pre-existing network of paths and the power grid. I've done that. Incubate a Struthiomimus with the Mohammed Hammond Creation Lab. Oof. Um, incubate a, a dinosaur. And here now comes, comes the real test: incubating a dinosaur. You'll start with a Struthiomimus. Select the Creation Lab and pick a hatchery bay. There's enough genome data for your first viable dinosaur. And incubate, because we uh, what we can do actually is when we modify the genome, once we uh, unlock extra parts, we can. Oh, we've got some parts here already, which is delightful. So we can already upgrade our Stuthiomimus, and this will decrease the viability. But it makes dinosaurs rating go up. I know this probably isn't the best thing to do at the start. How do I go back? Oh, escape, not back space. Uh, incubate. And what the skin means is you can create. Of the ambitious, undoing extinction, playing with nature's laws. What can possibly go wrong? You can create dinosaurs with different skin colors and tones, and it makes them really unique. Come on, Doctor. You know we've learned so much, and invested even more in our Jurassic operations since the last time. Yeah, there's been five films at this point. 
all with this going wrong. Yes, Mr. Finch, yes, the, the last time, there's always a last time, and a next. Yeah, these two hate each other. And ultimately, I don't like Mr. Whatever his name is either. And Strictly Mimus. And now we get to release our first dinosaur. And here she is. Because all dinosaurs Life in this game are sheep. It begins. The most precious moment, the result of incalculable actions and reactions, trials and errors, genetic mutations and unknowable combinations, chaos, all leading to a living, breathing, thinking being, an entity, distinct and unique. And now we, you, just manufacture them. So, well done. I guess. Problem is, I like Mr. Malcolm. Or Dr. Malcolm, despite the fact she doesn't like us. Anyway, this is our first dinosaur. Uh, and at the moment, you know, that isn't... Isn't a very nice name, STR001. So we are going to call... Uh, what I do is I usually look at the name of the dinosaur and take part from... Uh, part of the name and call them that. So I think this one... Between Mimu from Mimus. Actually, it's probably Mimu then. But there you go, Mimu. And what we're going to want to do, and what I do at the start, is I make life easier for myself. The Hammond Foundation has three main areas of interest. Oh, yeah, that's this bit of Entertainment and science. Cheers. I've already Thanks nudged the heads of each division to reach out to you personally. They'll offer opportunities and incentives for you to be part of their team. Choose one of their contracts. It'll help you develop your facility. Now, I believe this starts... Um, what you choose here changes what you get later. I'm going to go with Entertainment Division. Hey, I'm Eisen. I've been hearing good things about you. I'm in charge of the Entertainment Division here. 25 grand. Build connection power and exhibition center. What is the world's greatest show if no one sees it? Don't answer. That's rhetorical. What are these? And painfully obvious. Oh, they're the What I'm saying is that we need people in yep. our parks. Uh, Fill exhibition up our facilities center. with warm bodies. Numbers bring revenue, excitement, and opportunities. I like having everything, sort of all the admin things in one place. I think I'm actually, I haven't done this in my other save, party, uh, save game, so I'm sure this is going to end up confusing me. Contracts can be requested from the division heads building, building inside constraints. the control room. Complete these oh, to increase your reputation and gain oh. additional revenue to keep expanding your park. Come on. Do it. Train constraints. Delightful. Oh. I nearly had it. Oh. Nearly. Oh, I saw it then. Come on. The temperamental thing. Come on. Oh, good lord. Oh. There you go. Built. So, one more thing. Your reputation. Your rep, quote unquote. Keep an eye on it, okay? If you have a solid reputation with a division, you're more likely to benefit from them. Financially, I mean. But, like life, it's a balancing act. Each division is vying for your attention, and if they don't get it, they tend to take it personally. Alright, so there are some other things we want to do. Uh, one of the things I do is I usually split this enclosure in half. Um, and what that does is it means you can have carnivores and omnivores next to each other without them really being... Murdering each other, because that's what they'll do. Uh, and you don't have to build an extra enclosure. Taking notice of your success? As your reputation increases with them, so too Mr. does the opportunity oh, to tackle more challenging missions. It's because um, I usually call the first one Becky, or something similar. Strat. So... Ah, oh, yeah. Uh, right. Are we free to play now? Can we... 
Yes, right. I have noticed a few things, such as... They don't have any food. Oh, good lord. Who's transmitting from me? To me? Hey, it's Isaac. How you doing? I got some cool stuff you need to be a part of, so I'm putting it out there. Come on and help the winning team. Mine. <laughs> oh, this is a good one. This is where you get the dinosaur. Uh, the carnivore dinosaur. That's what I want. If you want, quickly, just to allow uh, Mimu to live. Put a feeder there. Alright. Next. All right, just look, while he starts talking. The These dinosaurs, we have one unlike any other on the planet. Theme parks rely on drawing people in. And what is more attractive than new dinosaurs? Well, me, of course. <laughs> yeah, no, what I'm saying is, let's get some fresh dinos in the hopper. So what I'm doing at the moment is I'm just building a small second enclosure. All right, and there's a few other things you need to do, such as gate, uh, Okay, so I just need to be careful of money and voice cracks. Alright, so that's that done. Now, just while that's... whilst we're going to do the mission in a second, I don't know why I'm pointing, I'm, I'm sitting here pointing at the screen. Uh, we're just going to get Mimo a friend, except this one won't be uh, in arid pattern. This will be Nalgene. Uh, back. This bit's the laggy bit. Uh, incubate that dinosaur. You know what, we'll get a third one. Uh, not of Mimu, but whatever we're going to call this next one. Incubate. Because these are the really cheap ones. Right. There are a lot of other things you want. You want... Um, Uh, it'll, uh, yeah, the Expedition I... Center will allow you to send dig teams around the world in search of new dino fossils. DNA can be extracted from these fossils, which our scientists can then turn into living, breathing dinosaurs. And that's our true lifeblood. Portugal. So all of these places will have different uh, DNA. So here, that's just Ceratops. That has Struthiomimus uh, Triceratops and Edmontosaurus. Uh, all herbivores, triceratops only, cer uh, those two only. And what you want really is if you're looking for a specific dinosaur, like we are, we can go to a specific place. So I think we're going to send our group out to Portugal. Um, but we do want a lot more dinosaurs overall. Good! Your first expedition team is out. They'll bring back yes. what they find Ooh, to the fossil rain. center for extraction. I thought this was, um, Spain, not Britain. Right, so we're going to release this one. Yeah, we can have a look. Because it's different to Mimu. As you can see. Not quite as yellow and purple, more... Sort of... Your job is simple, what really? you think. Create dinosaurs which attract visitors to your facilities. Right. Brings in capital, money, huh? Which now, means we have an you issue can do here, which is research to build better facilities and create more and we'll dinosaurs. Break out. And there you go. A circle of life. So we've just got to get them out. Nature and commerce. Before we name them. See? Simple. I should we'll prob uh, probably leave this open. Because we do have that second Struthia minus. We'll skip this one because we've already seen that dinosaur, why don't I press incubate? I wanted to release these. Yep, let's get that intro or cutscene or whatever. Come on, close. Thank you. Where's the. You're Struthy of minus 3. You are Struthy of minus 2. You will be. Uthy. All of these things are going to be completely random, by the way. These names aren't going to be pre-chosen. But if you do want to have a dinosaur named after you, um, make sure to join the Vanguard SMP Discord server. Uh, this one can be Ruth. A very standard name. Compared with uh, Mimu and Umi. I've already forgotten. 
Um, what, who are you? Uthi. Yeah, it's Uthi, Ruth, and Mimu. And if we're lucky, we'll be able to get a certain number of them, so we'll have, like, Strat, Hyom, and Imus. Or something like that, where we can span out the name. But, so the idea of this, this is just a sort of temporary holding pen. Uh, this helps out in the future. Then you can open either gate 3 or gate 2 here. Uh, and what this will mean is you can either have herbivores and they can run out that way, or carnivores who will run out this way. Uh, but what you do need to be careful with is, well, <laughs> look at that, they're having a meeting! Alright, let's have a look at Ruth. You can see they all have needs, so they need a certain amount of grassland, a bit a certain amount of forest, a certain amount of wetland, maximum population, uh, and social. Social's sort of the same group. You should extract genomes from fossils is total that have been collected inside your fossil center. Or dinosaurs. That will increase the amount of viable data you have to create dinosaurs. Alright, and what we've got to do now is extract. Now, amber is of the highest quality, so you want to extract that first. Uh, these two, two need to be done. Now, there is certain things you'll want to do. We can get some more Struthiomimus, get a bit of Triceratops, and Edmontosaurus, I believe that is. Uh, and all of these will basically raise the stars at the bottom and improve our rating. Now. What you'll also want, in order to get more people to see the dinosaurs better, are our viewing platforms. So I believe they come under enclosures. Yep, yeah, viewing gallery. And we'll be able to just pop, pop it. Put link constraint there. And this won't have power or a path connection. Unfortunately, it is right next to the path. I can't, I can't, there we go, viable genome. Alright, I can't see. I'm very laggy. I don't know what's worse, treating these creatures like grist for the mill or propping them up as curiosities. Delightful. We we'll also want power. So what you do is you build a pylon. I should note you build a substation, my mistake. You get a small substation. Uh, so there. Actually, no, we're going to expand over this way later as well, so we'll probably build it up there. Then you can use the pylon. And it taps the power grid. Which is done. Uh, now it's going to get us to incubate the Ceratosaurus. Uh, I don't think we'll have any extra sort of genomes here. I. Half a million dollar dinosaur. Do we have any other genes? So we have no skin. We do have resilience. Robust digestion. This raises the rating and resilience. So I think we'll get that. Now I'm hoping it doesn't fail. That is... Oh, a third of our money gone? Now there are other buildings you want. Uh, and these are all important. Build connecting Lambert, power emergency center. Security. Shelter, sorry, Yours, not center. There's and mine. Welcome to the islands. Cheers. Yeah, let's so build that emergency shelter. We want to keep our animals under control while simultaneously encouraging instinctive behaviors. Because these animals have potential as combatants. Oh dear. And that doesn't go well. Right. Emergency shelter. Look. Everyone's fear object, myself included, is to have these animals running yeah. free and loose in the park. But we can't exploit them globally without taking some chances. Alright, and build connection power emergency shelter. Our money's gone down a lot, by the way. Um, I should have been more careful. But, yeah, in the ops building, you really want an ACU center and a ranger station. They cost, they'll cost 800,000 uh, total, and that's basically what we've got. What we will probably want is some sort of guest facility. So, a gift shop, 
fast food, restroom. You know what? Let's go to the gift shop just because that's the cheapest. Um, see if we can get it to connect to that path there. Happily. No? We just sort of get to slit in there. There we go. Uh, we'll need a path, but that's fine. And what this will do is these will make us money. Some of these new buildings may be of use to the security division. That's a job well done on your part. Cheers. Anyway, this, uh, I'm not sure a gift shop would be, but how's that incubation? Oh, it's nearly done. Right, but this will basically provide us money whilst we're doing dinosaur stuff. There we go. Ceratosaurus ready to release. Hello? Here we go. My first carnivorous dinosaur. Claire Deering, and I've been on these islands before. On Isla Nublar, I made some mistakes, and I've tried to set them right. I believe in what we're doing, and I believe in these dinosaurs. Thank you, Claire. You made very many, many mistakes. But hopefully, Ceratosaurus there is now in his enclosure. Just close this gate. A happy guest is what we strive to maintain here. Right. You do that by making sure their needs are met. Um, In a way, it's kind of like taking care of the dino. That wasn't meant to happen. He got through the fence. I don't know what I'm meant to do here. He got just with more demands and less right. understanding. <laughs> Am I right? What I'm going to have to do is just. Fence him off. Oh, this is actually going to be expensive. Uh, delete. Demolish mode. Demolish that segment. Go over that way. Alright. We open that gate. And what you do is you go round and back into your enclosure. Okay? Looking. Yes, there's water here. Look. Look. No glitching through the wall this time, please. Yeah, leg it. Go on. Go on. There's no need to be scared. It's a gate. A gate that you somehow broke last time. What are you doing? Go on. What's that? What's that? I don't know what that means. Come on. Go on. Through the gate. And properly this time so you can't get through the fence. No, properly, without your tail stuck in it, please. Right, close that gate. And it's stuck in here now. Beautiful, right. Ooh, that bit of fence. And I deleted the wrong bit. Whoops. Why are you curved? Don't be curved. Thank you. Right, back to delete mode. Thank you. 
Nice. Right. We're going to complete this mission, by the way. But first, we do want to make sure he can eat. So, what's cheaper? Goat. Or just meat. Tell you what, the goat's more impressive. You can have a goat feeder. Um, now, when you've got feeders, you want the ranger station. Problem is, we've got to do these things down there. And money isn't exactly a premium right now. It's not that money isn't an object at the moment, it's money is very much an object. And at the moment, an object we are. There, are you connected to power? Yeah, that counts as connected to power. Wonderful, wonderful. We can get you just a. Line up there. Building. Oh. Come on. Right. Get built there. It's all very higgledy piggledy at the start. Um, and so. No, don't do that. So. Connect there. Beautiful. Right, that's done. And now. We want to go to the op center, research, and research some thing or another. Well, seeing as there's only the one building, it would be that. Uh, yes, clothes shop. Oh god. Um, genetic research and enclosures. What's the electric fence? Won't need us at the moment. Let's research these. What genetic research is there? Trait cosmetic. Baryonyx, Condotaurus, Gasmosaurus, Deinonychus, Diplodocus, Draco Rex, Dominus Rex, Kentrosaurus, Myosaurus. I'm not even going to pronounce that one. Not that, no idea. Pachycephalosaurus, Pentaceratops, Sauropelta, Sinoceratops, Taurosaurus, Triceratops, Trinus Anosaurus Rex and Velociraptor. None of them do we have at the moment. Um, I have a Struthiomimus fossil. 20 grand, we'll do that. Alright, construct and power Things a clothes shop here, huh? and a viewing gun. I love what you're I, doing with the place. I'm Barely able to afford this. Hope Mr. Entertain Me knows this. What do you mean in water? Is the water there? Oh, maybe there is. Okay, that's fine. It can be next to fast food place, wherever that place was. So, nearly touching. Oh no, you can connect them. Oh, well, that means it's connected to our path. Oh. Ah, Dr. Dua. This is our new director of operations. 350 grand. Beautiful. I'm aware, Cabot. I'm Dr. Dua. I run the science division of our operation. Yes. Okay. You're going to need to build your reputation in the science division. Not easy with me around, but you'll manage. Yeah, that means managing our dinosaur population and seeing that they are flourishing. Right, we'll have to go on an expedition then. Um, increase something to 60%. You're at 63%. Ooh, that's annoying. What's the easiest to get to 60? 63. 48 74, 48 we'll go for Triceratops money is definitely not Ooh, easy close shop and a viewing gallery oh, viewing gallery counts that's delightful even if it doesn't cover our dino over here now 
At the moment, he's I happy. Like what I'm seeing. Let's keep it up. Satisfaction is what we aim to give our guests. Make them appreciate the little things. And the big things with the teeth and glassy eyes that could swallow them whole. That's not something you should be mentioning. Um, what's next, Mr. Clement? Or was that it? Was that what we had to do with him done? Mission number one complete. Yay. A million. Lovely. And Draco hey, Rex. Go. We've got a park running at maximum happiness, and our guest numbers are up as a result. I'm going to call it maximum happiness. Division, the envy of the rest. We get the results, am I right? <laughs> they don't like the lack of variety. That's fine. Um, when oh. the parks are running well, yeah. our scientific research improves. Yeah. Of course, I'd never tell this to Isaac directly. What's the issue here? I was going to add. No. No. No, 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 no. Too late. Heard it. Later, Doc. And those two are fighting. Lovely. Ugh. Now, right. I want... Operations building. This is what we're going to do now. Ranger station is more important at the moment. But if a dinosaur escapes, you want the ACU center. So, really at the moment, it's a matter of... Um... Why is there water everywhere? Like, I know it's important for people to live and everything, but... Right. Well, the best thing about this... Is you get to drive... These. Now, why can't... Right, so there's not enough electricity. It looks like you run out of power. That's not good. Build more power stations, or increase your output. Yeah! Hello. Yeah, I know how power works. Thank you. This is annoying. Upgrade. Empty upgrade slot. I have... Nothing. Right, research. Please, research me up. Power upgrades. I want... Um... Improved output. I'm Owen Grady. Owen to my friends. I've seen things I'd rather not talk about, but it hasn't dampened my commitment to the dinosaurs. Raptors more generally, and me and Blue specifically. We have a special relationship, like what I have with Claire. Less complicated. Anyway, nice to meet you. You're nice to meet you, but you don't sound like this Pratt. Right, that's three minutes. Um. Anyway, I think to end the video off, we're going to have a drive around in our brand new Jeeps. Once it's built. Okay, so I've managed to finish off the contract with the science people, with the genome. Uh, we've got some platinum actually, or silver I think. Possibly silver, probably silver, silver, which you get money from. Lovely, lovely jubbly. And I, I built a viewing station here, the substation. I managed to get the power sorted, and if you look down here, we now have Ranger Station up and running. Um, shouldn't be a bad idea. It wouldn't be a bad idea, rather, to get the ACU sensor. But I don't know how much spare power we have at our small Station 7, so not enough. That'll be something for next episode. So now we get to do an exciting thing. Uh, we can paint our Ranger team. Now the issue is that I haven't unlocked it on this save file, so we'll have to just stay as that colour. But the most exciting part, driving the vehicle. And I must say, the game, from this view at least, looks beautiful. And the best part, of course, is the everybody jump out the way of your car. 
and most games. Oh, and that giant hill we've just come up as well is great fun when you're going down it. Um, then you get a handbrake, so you can attempt. And not succeed at handbrake turns up. There you go, unlocks new vehicles again. I think one of them also is to go fast for a long enough time. And the main jeep is to hold, uh, fly high enough for a long enough amount of time. There you go, we've just unlocked the red jeep too. I'm just wondering where this path goes. So it just goes through the jungle. Oh, it just stops. Wonderful. Should we go see some dinosaurs quickly then? Oh, actually, hold on. The path keeps going. Great fun to sort of face boring right? Ah, we're here. Change the colour of the jeeps, I think we'll probably go with the red jeep. I thought you failed to drive in test achievement unlocked. Um oh good lord, look at this path. Right. Tell you what. Gates opening. All the gates are opening. What we'll do is we'll have a look at our Struthia Mike. There they are. Struthia Mikes is we can earn money. Sorry, I'll camp over. And photo dinosaurs. Look at that! Look at all that value. Right. Ah, oh, I think we're stuck. Right, just back up then. Right. Let's go have a look at our Ceratosaurus. No, don't open that gate, I'm not going through that one. Open this gate, thank you. Right, where is he? Oh, I don't think we've named him yet. That's how we'll end the video. Hello. Yes, lovely. Now, they do actually attack the cars, I believe. Tell you what. Small for Instagram. Oh, that's a lot more money. Hey, well, take another one. What? I think this is probably not going to get quite as much because it's. There you go. Species repetition penalty. Fine, right. Onwards. Oh, this isn't good. We open the gate and the dinosaur's there. Right, go. Go and don't look back. Oh. That's all for road for ya. Yeah, just down there, that's it. Right. But that's going to happen next episode because the next thing to do Lavin here with a new contract is name our Ceratosaurus, and I think, you and I think I'm going to call you Terra because ultimately I was scared that he was just going to leg it. Oh, sorry, he's too tired to leg it. So Terra can just stay there, and Terra sleeping. Keep looking for other dinosaurs we may be able can to you? domesticate. Well, more accurately, put on the road to domestication. The way we'll be able to control them is by letting them control themselves. Their Cheers. natural hierarchy. That means we need more samples. This expedition can help. Can you let me do my outro, please? Thank you. And with that, it is time to end. Thank you very much for watching. I hope to see you in the next video. Goodbye. I